Hello, ladies and gentlemen of the internet. It is I, the Roshi, and look at that. I don't know anything about this. I haven't seen any of the trailers. I'm approaching this from a completely different way, at least in my point of view, than what I did with Genshin. I haven't seen anything about the characters. I don't know where this story leads. If there is lore, I don't know it. When I do come across something that maybe I am aware of, I'll, I'll, maybe I'll talk about it. But as of right now, off the top of my head, this is very, very new. These videos might not be what you normally see. Uh, I probably won't be popping in interrupting as much as I do in my Genshin videos. But who knows? Maybe I will. I'm not sure. It depends on what I have to say, I guess. Okay. Here we go. Terminus. Oh. <laughs> like the classical this. There's not actually a violin there. What's happening? Wait, is that? I think that's the Kafka character. Maybe. I came at a bad time. No, no. I think you couldn't have timed it better. 234715 system time. Very punctual, Kafka. Mm, Elio always tells the exact future. So what's with the explosion just now? Was that also part of his script? Uh-huh. 234459 system time. The pulses from the explosion cause a massive breakdown from the master control system. You did that? No. The Antimatter Legion did it. They completely invaded the space station two system hours ago. Alright. So do we need to fight the Legion? I don't know. Elio didn't say anything about it, so it doesn't matter. Got it. So from now on, I'll be in charge of this operation. Copy. Can you let me have some fun this time? Our last few operations turned out to be pretty dull. Sorry, I'm afraid there is not much I can do for you. Our task this time is just to place the target properly. But if you want to go look for some fun yourself, I won't stop you. I mean, after all. <laughs> after all, Elio didn't put it in the script. Why would it matter? Okay. So we're just in it, I guess. Uh, use basic attack on selected enemy. This won't take long. Select the enemy on your right as your target, okay? Switch to your skill for a stronger attack. This is the blast. Use skill on the selected enemy. Okay, cool. So there's like a little confirmation thing you have to do to make sure that's what you're doing. Okay. You start in the game as Kafka? I like her. Alright. Okay, that's sprint. Cool. Is there like a stamina meter? Or do you sprint forever? Two hours later. Looks like I could sprint forever. I love that. Okay. Herda's portrait? 
Who's this? Herta? Yeah. <laughs> she looks so young. She was already famous in the last Amber era, no? She has to be at least a hundred years old. She's a member of the Genius Society, and an emanator of Noose the Erudition. She can probably age backwards if she wanted. <laughs> yeah, I seem to recall that over half of the Genius Society's 80-odd members had a normal death. Wasn't there someone who lived for a dozen days or so? What was their name? Oh. <laughs> That's pretty normal. Aren't the immortal bosses in games always waiting for the protagonist to come kill them? <laughs> Immortality is not always a good thing. <laughs> oh, what an alliance joke. Huh. I'm enjoying the voice acting so far. I know I've only really heard Kafka and the mysterious person over the, the comm. You could tell that they're having a lot of fun with it. Because she had little, like, hiccups in her voice line. But not in hiccups as in, like, actual mistakes made. But to show that there are little imperfections. Like when she'd start her sentence trying to come up with that, she'd be like, yeah, I don't, what, what was I saying? Like there was that little bit of that, yeah, that you know? I, I, I like that. It, there shows like there's a more, there's there's like this naturalness to the speech that it's not as reading off of a script. I could only attract this much. Did you really want the entire Legion to come here? This lot won't be able to slow down the Astral Express crew. Relax. A Doomsday Beast is also here. Attack selected enemy to trigger combat. All right. <laughs> Did the thing. It's weak to being hurt. Awesome. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. Whoa. Sensation. Remember it. All characters possess a powerful ultimate, which can be used when their energy is full. So, oh, so mine's like halfway right now? Okay. Fight enemies to regenerate energy. Okay. Ow. Okay, you're at full energy. Activate your ultimate now. I'm doing it. I didn't do it. Good time. Oh, here we go. Ooh, nice little splash screen. Okay, use ult, ult, yeah, use ultimate to attack all enemies. Time to say bye. That's awesome. Love that. That was sick. Oh no! Ooh! But he got disintegrated. Cleaning up other people's mess isn't in my job description. You know, Kafka. Uh, yeah, yeah. Where did you send it, Silverwolf? Okay, Silverwolf. Some random coordinates. Not important. You care about where that Void Ranger ended up? Of course not. I'm just amazed at this fancy technique of yours, as usual. Just a little trick of tampering with the data of reality. I wouldn't call it fancy. What were you looking at so intently just now? Let me see. She's got like star eyes, I just noticed. Kind of. Herta's Toys. A catalog featuring the space station's collection of rare items. They've got a lot of interesting gadgets. Like what? There's this gun. It can rate any creature within its crosshair as a score from 0 to 100. Uh, doesn't sound very interesting. Aren't you curious about how much you would score? I kind of want to know mine. Fine. I guess we can swing by and play with it if it's not too far. What's our destination? Go down the corridor behind the door on the left. There's a room where some kind of rare item is stored. And so that's where the Stellaron is. That's where we can find out where the Stellaron is. Silverwolf Story has joined the team temporarily. Okay. Okay. So now I have Silverwolf running around. 
Man, there's a lot of detail that goes into these characters. Which which is great. Okay, meet up with Silverwolf and leave the reception center. Alright, so I have to leave the reception center. She is very small. Oh, I got... Oh, no. Okay, here we are. You find lots of readable items on your journey. Do spend some time reading them to learn about people's lives. And the lore in different worlds. Absolutely. That will be a thing. In case if anyone is wondering, I am actually reading the majority of the things that I've been collecting for the lore. However, because it takes a lot of time, you might not see me actually go through that in these kinds of episodes. If you're interested, you can actually see me read through this stuff by becoming a member on this channel or on my Patreon. Scholar Tearing Up gets access to the uncut recording sessions of this gameplay. This is not to say that you won't ever get access to them. I very well might want to make a compilation video of sorts where it's just me only doing reading. I've been thinking about doing this for my Genshin playthrough as well. Or perhaps even doing a stream where I just spend time reading the lore that's in these games through these articles that I find, or items, etc. For now, it's just a thought. But if waiting is too hard, then you can become a member on my Patreon or here on my YouTube to get access to that kind of thing. And that's what it is. Back to the video. Emblem of the Space Station. Herta, have you ever met her? I'm curious about the tastes of someone who used their own name for a space station. Mm. Never seen the real one. Saw plenty of her portraits, though. Oh, what a pity. I think techno babble is cool. However, me as a person, I do find it a little difficult to follow sometimes. Um, so if I ask stupid questions every once in a while because something went over my head, Please forgive me. But when it comes to... That's a cool little animation right there. still not open. But you know what I mean. like. But when it comes to like the, the high-tech stuff and we're talking about these different things, like some for some reason, sometimes I get, I get lost. <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Silverwolf, so you're cool and all, but I mean... I gotta... I, we gotta stick to this. The central area of the space station is up ahead. There will be lots of Legion Void Rangers there. Okay. Hello. Gotcha. That breathing sensation. Remember it. Ooh, what a thing to say. That breathing sensation. Remember it. Wow. Okay. Th that's what I feel like whenever I get a cold. Uh, characters and enemies act in sequence from the top to the bottom of the action order. Okay, so this is like the initiative. Got it. Ultimates are not affected by the action order Time and can be used in any turn. Okay. Ooh, I like her sword. You are at full energy. Activate your ultimate now. Uh, after an ultimate becomes available, it can be used immediately. This combat needs optimizing. Okay. Use several wolves ultimate to defeat enemies. Hmm. At this speed, too slow. I do consider myself um, a strategist of sorts at times, but it takes me a while to build up to oh. it. Hi again, miss me. I know I said I wasn't going to be doing this a lot, but I feel like I need to on occasion to give myself some kind of excuse. Despite reading through the tutorials, uh, some of this stuff didn't stick, so I might be confused and ask some stupid questions, maybe do some bad moves during combat, and I hope you can forgive me. It's a new game. I, I eventually do get the hang of it. It's just not going to be in these early episodes, so... Yeah, thanks for watching. And just like my Genshin Impact playthrough, all of this has been recorded months ahead of time. So you could give me some advice, some suggestions, and by all means, please do. 
but there's a good chance that I already know it. But at the same time, this is a very new game, so there's a lot that I probably still don't know. So do what you want, just no spoilers, please. Besides some character names, I don't know this story at all. Thank you. Someone or something is up ahead. Looks like we're the ones getting ambushed. But they're the ones getting besieged. Alright. So this is an ambush now? May as well kill them all. Skill points is a combat resource shared by the whole team. Okay. That's the thing. I see, and then it would take one away. Consume skill points to use skills. <laughs> All skill points have been used. Skills cannot be used when insufficient skill points are present. Use basic attack to recover team skill points. Got it. So a basic attack will gain us skill points back. Didn't hurt. That breathing sensation. Remember. <laughs> More enemies. Time for a buzz. <laughs> I know I could have done Kafka's and just hit all three of them, but I just wanted to see what she did. That's probably the thing. That was probably the thing to do. Oh, she hits two people, not all three. I thought she had three people. Stand still. This won't take long. You took the bait just like not a single soul here. Impressive evacuation work. Did Herda organize it herself? According to the access history, she hasn't logged in here for over six months. The evacuation was directed by the acting lead researcher, a girl named Asta. It doesn't ring a bell. Oh, right. Elio said we wouldn't run into Herta. It seems she really isn't here. Where's the Stellaron? Elio's script doesn't include any info about the location of the Stellaron, which means in the future he foresees... We would find the Stellaron in a non-physical way. This space station is packed with extraordinary objects. I wouldn't be surprised if there's one that can make it happen. Well, hiding something extraordinary with something extraordinary. This is pretty Herta. I assume you know what to do. I mean, you've read the catalog for quite a while. I've got all the clues we need. The only piece missing is a simple trick. Help me investigate the terminal in this room. Our item might be inside. Okay, the stage is yours. So, I don't feel like we're the good guys right now. Are we the baddies? Maybe we will be at some point, but... Doesn't seem that way. I don't know if we're the bad guys, but I don't feel like we are the good guys. I feel like we are people doing their own thing right now. Or at least these two characters. Huh? I can't see the memory storage for this terminal. This is the monitoring room. They must have deleted the records and made a run for it. Classic. I can see the whole space station on the surveillance screen, but not the Stellaron. Even if you could, it'd be a trap. Herta doesn't display her collections. <sighs> Make your way over here then. 
There's no point in trying to search like this. So, got a master plan? I'm all ears. It's a matter of hacking the surveillance system directly. Ah, I see. Hertus collections aren't in the system, so anything unaffected should be our target. Oh. Simple, crude, but effective. Look, found it. Chaos in the deep interact with the curio to unravel the secret in the monitoring room. Hmm, what's this? Item number 211, line spot. A simple light deflecting field. It allows an object in its field to pass unnoticed, but if a different item ceases to be obvious, the object gets revealed. So, Herta hides her collection with something as simple as this? The simplest method is the hardest to spot. Isn't that our motto? Hmm. It's like a like a, like a passageway or that's what the room looks like maybe? Strange thing number two. The data suggests it's just an ordinary hologram, but it has an added layer. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look. Don't worry, this place won't be our grave. Interesting. Whoa. She's a member of the Genius Society, all right. The Stellaron is up ahead. Let's hurry. This is Stellaron. What Stellaron hunters throughout the universe all hunt for. But in truth, it's all just a front. Elio knows it. Blade knows it. And you know it. Stellaron hunters have another true goal. I don't know what it is. That's why the Stellaron that Herta sealed away will be put to another use. Once Silverwolf breaks its seal, you'll have to take it and place it inside a kind of vessel that's been waiting for just this occasion. So it seems like it's a power source of something. Huh. It has its own security system. I guess even for Herda, Stellaron is no ordinary rarity. Can you get it? Of course. Even the genius Herda can't compete with me when it comes to hacking. Good. Then I'll also count on you with the preparation of the receptacle. The receptacle's ready. Your decision. <laughs> Elio said this decision will bring about lots of changes. He also said... It must be you who makes it. What? It's a person? This is the this is the playable character. Why are you standing around? Because Having second thoughts. Listen. Yeah, we've always been the ones taking Stellarons. It's the first time we're giving one out. You know, I'm gonna go Stell. You're gonna think for this long. Yes, I am gonna game. think this long. God, <laughs> God forbid if there was any more character customization. Changing receptacle code name. I go by Roshi, but because I am playing as female character now, I'm gonna go as Rosha. Click and hold to complete verification. Uh, come on, I'll pick for you. Silverwolf, nice you're there quickly becoming go. not my favorite. Not that you were before, but still, now you're further away. Sassin me. How much does she remember? Hmm. I'll remember you. Time to get up. Don't touch me there. Oh. <laughs> uh, 
I'm I'm gonna say her name. Great. So you remember me? Kind of. <laughs> Listen, you are in a daze right now. You don't know who you are, why you're here, or what you're going to do next. Mm. You think I look familiar, but you're not sure if you should trust me. Yes. None of that matters. Oh. All you need to know is that I'm leaving, and oh. you will be left all alone on this space station. From now on, you needn't think about your past or doubt yourself. That's hard to do when you say it like that. Listen, in the near future, you will encounter all kinds of perils and hardships, but you will also have many wonderful experiences. You'll meet companions who will treat you like family and embark on surreal adventures with them. That's great. At the end of your journey, all that perplexes you and troubles you will resolve. This is your future that Elio has foreseen. Do you like it? I don't know. Where, where, uh, uh, where are you going? The next stop to pave the way for the future that is written. Okay. It's like weaving brocade. You and I can only add one gold thread each time. But eventually, we will make a gorgeous pattern. I like pretty sh shapes. How long do you think you need? According to the script, the Astral Express crew is arriving soon. We should avoid being seen by them. I know, Silverwolf. Just give me another minute. I must leave now. Don't worry, someone will come and find you very soon. Just go with them. You won't remember a thing except me. A Kafka. When you have a chance to make a choice, make one that you know you won't regret. Mm, okay. So do choices really matter? Weren't the coordinates sent out from the space station? Who cares? They're here and alive. Do they look like a mannequin to you? <gasps> Weak heartbeat and pulse. March, you better do CPR. Someone's going to have to do it. Wait, stop it. They're awake. Are you all right? Can you hear me? Do you remember your name? I don't remember a thing. Aw, oh, this isn't good. Can you try harder? I'm sure you can at least remember your name. My name is Rosha. Nice to meet you. My name's Don Hung. And this is March 7th. That... Someone gave you a date as a name? Okay. This space station was just attacked by the antimatter legion. We came to help with the rescue at the request of lead researcher Asta. Antimatter Legion? Lead researcher Asta. Where should I go? Um, the, the Antimatter Legion? Moon zoned by the destruction. You're lucky the most dangerous Lord Ravager among them isn't around. Just some nasty minions. We'll take those invaders out soon. Don't worry. Okay. Lead uh, research Asta. Uh, a petite cutie with pink hair? Oh. Madame Herta appointed her to be the acting lead researcher. Oh. That girl really needs to step up. I can't believe her own employee doesn't even know her name. Are you talking... Who are you talking about? Where should I go? Back to the master control zone. Asta and the other researchers have gathered there. Plus, that's where we park the Astral Express. Don't you worry. We'll protect you from the monsters and clear up this mess. 
Okay. Um, who are you guys? Don Hung and I are members of the Astral Express crew. Okay. The Express has some dealings with Madame Herta. So we come to visit the space station from time to time. We just so happened to arrive during this invasion. Of course, as a <clears throat> crew of heroes, we're happy to lend a hand. The Astral Express? Yeah. You've never seen it? The Express comes here every once in a while. It's a unique train that can travel between the stars with the power of the Trailblaze Eon. Okay. I'll show you once we're back to the Master Control Zone. Let's go then. You and March go back together. Our land from the security department lost contact in the vicinity. I need to find him first. Oh, all right. You stay safe. Okay, bye, Dan. Hmm. Maybe you should bring this. The Legion are rampaging through the space station like a pack of wolves. This trip won't be a walk in the park. It's better if you have something to protect yourself. Is that a is that a baseball bat? Just a suggestion, though. You're safe as long as you stick with me. Oh, okay. Leave and see what's going on outside. All right. Wasn't there a baseball bat somewhere? Or do I already have this it? This place is full of fancy little gadgets. Heard us collection. I really don't get why she'd go out of her way to collect them and then leave them here to gather dust. Uh, it's the Antimatter Legion. So these crazy jerks made it all the way here. Watch this. I hit it. I hit the thing. Okay. Uh, the type icon indicates the enemy's weakness type. Oh. The white bar below the weakness types indicate the enemy's toughness. Okay. Using attacks of the same type as the enemy's weakness types will reduce the enemy's toughness. Okay. Select the enemy on the right as your target. Yeah, it's weak to uh, ice. This attack can deplete the enemy's toughness to zero. Boom! Use ice attacks to inflict weakness break, causing enemies to freeze. Let's go. Okay, use physical attacks to inflict weakness breaks, causing enemies to bleed. Oh, it recovered real quick from the break. Okay. There we go. Ouch. You have the worst luck running into me. <laughs> Let's make it quick. Batter up. Okay. You're stronger than you look. Seem to be quite the fighter. I know I'm supposed to go that way, but. Don't have access. That's fine. I understand. I'm new here. You don't want to give me access to everything. That'd be crazy. All right. What's going on here, everybody? Name's Rosha. I'm new. What's going on? What? What? So we'll take that elevator on the central platform to go down to the master control zone. Do you know the way? I don't. Um, I noticed that you're not wearing the space station staff uniform. Do you really work here? I never said I did. Uh, I don't remember. Memory loss, huh? You must have been injured. Sure. Never mind. I won't ask if you don't want to talk about it. The only thing I remember is Kafka, who, as far as I'm concerned, is my mother in many ways. Let's go. I'll take you to the safe zone. She brought me into this world. 
Don't mind me, just swinging my baseball bat around. Just testing to see how strong your facility is. So it's it's weak to physical, so I can go BAM. And I've already made you weak. Right? Oh no, I, I but I I didn't make you weak, but I, I started the process. Rosha is locked on by the enemy and will be attacked first. That's not very nice. March 7th follows the path of preservation and can protect allies. Right. And I will select your skill to shield Rosha. With me out here, how can we lose? Yay, I'm protected. Thank you. Okay, shield will be displayed on the outer edge of the HP bar. Oh, okay, the white box right there. Oh, no, no, the little icon? The little icon. Got it. I'm shielded. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to attack that person. Oh, God, I messed up. Good thing I was shielded. When character takes damage, the shield effect will be reduced first. You can't run. Oh, it is the bar around it, too. Nice. Ouch. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Um. There we go. Oh, almost. You can't run. Nice. Nice little follow up. You have the worst luck running into me. Oh. They disappeared. I'm gonna test the thing. Rules are made to be broken. Okay. Oh, uh, she's a powerful character that follows the path of destruction. I am Rush's ultimate offers two powerful attack modes the single target mode and the multi target mode let's go single target i did not let's make it quick get it uh Try hard we're doing the thing check out this awesome move okay nice arrow oh my god That was pretty intense. That was cool. Shield. Okay, I like the shield ability that she has. Uh, I knew it. Um, it worked. Nah, I think the elevator's broken. I pressed all the buttons, but nothing happened. I don't think that's how you open. Yeah, okay. March 7th is pretty cool. I like her design. At first, it was I was like, eh, but now it's growing on me. There's something with like the pastel uh, gradient from the the whites to pinks to purples to blues to black. Too bad Don Hung's not here. He's like a walking encyclopedia. He knows a ton of complicated stuff. Maybe even elevator repair. Uh, I don't know that one. Hello, Don. Whoa! Uh, why are you here? And how did you get here before us? I took another route to the upper level, and I saw you guys from up there. Arlan is in the control room. He's been injured, but not fatally. You found him. Will he know what to do about this elevator? I suppose as the head of the security department, he should know. Then let's go talk to him. Oh. We got done. Cool. Use March 7th's technique to gain an edge in combat. Uh, E. Freeze. Oh, okay. Oh, and it's frozen. Okay. That's kind of cool. You have the worst luck running into me. I want to see how long this guy's frozen for. Uh, 
Uh oh. Step aside. All right, so I he does no recover pretty quick. Conflict. Hmm. Boom. I told you I could fight. Can I defend myself? Stay right there while I give you a present. Okay, I can. It's pretty cool. All right. Boom. My turn. Let's go. All right. You couldn't have done it without me. Let's check out Don over here. Strapping young gentleman. He's got fancy earrings. He has a pole arm. That was pretty cool. Hello, person. Hey, you're all together. Yeah. Yep, we're from the Astral Express. Oh, did Madame Herta send you to help? Not sure. It's just a coincidence. We came to deliver the rare relic Herta trusted us to find. We didn't expect to arrive during an invasion. Why is the Antimatter Legion targeting you guys? It seems they just ignored the surface of the planet and came straight to the space station. I have no idea. The Legion came at a very suspicious time, almost right after the security system suddenly failed. Hmm. Sounds like you were hacked. Lady... Lead researcher Asta immediately began to organize the evacuation. I was supposed to cover everyone as they evacuated, but I didn't expect to end up failing in this task. Damn. Don't be too hard on yourself. Your leg and dominant hand were injured. It was a wise decision to hide here and avoid a head-on encounter with the Legion. Yeah, most of the staff have been evacuated safely. So right now our highest priority is to return to the Master Control Zone and plan a counterattack. So... Do you know how to use the elevator? I couldn't start it. After the evacuation was complete, the elevators were all shut down to keep the Legion away from the Master Control Zone. Since Lady Asta sent you to look for me, I assume she must have given you the encryption key for accessing the elevator system? Oh, right. She did give me some sort of card. <sighs> March. Uh... <sighs> Did I put it? Huh. You. Ah, uh, here it is. Uh. <sighs> I find this amusing. Now that we found the key, we should get going. We can use that console over there to unlock the elevator. Okay. One second. I'm gonna look around the room. <gasps> What's in the box? <laughs> Nothing. Let's go. Okay. Hold on. I only activated the elevator on the highest floor. We'll have to go there to use it. Why? It's so far away. Because I mustn't give the Legion any chance to reach the master control zone by the elevator. I must ensure the safety of the station staff. <sighs> I mean... It makes sense, but I don't wanna. So I'll have to trouble you to take a bit of a detour. Apologies. I'm going upstairs so I can take an elevator to not go upstairs. Huh? You're not coming with us? My leg is injured. I'd only slow you down. I'll stay here and shut down the elevator once you've made it to the master control zone. Fine. You won't <laughs> slow us down. And you should be able to shut down the elevators from the master control zone. Right? Agreed. She and I made it here safely. And now we've also got Don hung. We're more than enough to protect you. We're we're pretty awesome. Let us worry about the antimatter legion. You just follow us and keep yourself alive. Yeah. 
Trust us. Don't overthink this. You can use me as a crutch. I don't want to go upstairs and hold a person. Don't overthink Thank this. You. Is that all? Damn, I was not happy about that. I mean, I, th I was happy, personally. Rosha, on the other hand, was not happy about that. Hello? Let's do the thing! Wait, I was ambushed? I thought I was doing the thing. Oh, I didn't do it right. Oh god, I didn't do it right. I messed up, I'm sorry. I thought I was gonna jump him. Step aside. I have no interest in stoking conflict. Yeah. All right. That's fun, though. The story in your own way. Yep, I'll do just that. I will reach the end of the story in my own way. Thank you for reminding me. Uh, hey, these shiny things. Are these light cones? I thought only the Interastral Peace Corporation had rare stuff like this. No. Light cones are Garden of Recollection technology. They allow you to carry memories around. Very potent enhancement items. I heard the corporation paid a lot for the usage rights. But I've no idea how Herta managed to get hold of one. They were acquired legitimately. That's all I can say. Take them. They're very useful in combat. Her don't mind if I do. Let us continue. Anything on the screen? Hmm. It's not very clear. Some components of the display seem to be damaged. I wonder how, why. Perhaps a baseball bat was involved. I'll never tell. Aw, is that it? We've reached the elevator already? That wasn't too many monsters. <gasps> I want that. Oh, probably shouldn't have said that. Might bring bad luck. I want that. You've grown, March. I will break a hole through the wall so I can get there. I don't see how my room connects to that. Okay. Maybe later. Oh! Move carefully. Okay. Uh, active two times speed to experience faster combat. Okay. I'm, I'm fine with it as is. I don't think I need to do that. Um, ah, yes. The two times speed. So, I don't use the two times speed here. Eventually, I do use it in future videos. And then I turn it off again. So there might be a couple videos in the future where I do have it. And then it'll return to me not doing it. Normally I use it when I'm grinding in the game off camera. Um, but yeah. Let me know. What is your opinion about the two times speed? The music's going off right now though. Ouch. Uh oh. My turn. Uh uh uh. Thank you. Stay right there while I give you a present. Let's go. Okay. Um use real time combat view to check character's current status. Oh god. Just a scratch. Try that again. Rules are made to be broken. Yeah. I'm breaking the rules, baby. Bam. Aside, I have no interest in still the time now. Just a scratch. Ow. You can't should have hit that guy. Oh god. No, I, I I have to select the target first. I'm dumb. We'll just end this guy before they get up and have a turn. 
Clemency? Okay. Never heard of it. The truth of life and death. Yes. This yes. Is but a vision. Get wrecked. That was an unreal projection. No! Ouch. Oh, insufficient energy. Now I have it. I try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. It's not doing a lot. I should probably try to get the the thing off first. Like the, like I have no interest the in weakness caught. break first, and then go crazy. Rules are made to be broken. Okay, it's angry. Oh, it's a lot. Hey, sore losers! You can't just gang up on us. Yeah. The heck. What was that about? Why does it always have to get this exciting? Anyway. At least you're back. Hello. March, Dun Hung. You've been through a lot. Oh, Hugh, Himeko, what took you so long? That last wave of antimatter legion came at us like a swarm of locusts. Have you ever tried shooting locusts with a bow? I haven't. I wouldn't have made a difference. My orbital cannon can deal with a whole bunch of enemies at once, but. I couldn't just blow up the space station with it. Herta would not like that. <sighs> Are you all right, Arlam? Asta's been worried about you. I'm fine. A quick patching up will do. Thanks for asking. I'll report the situation to lead researcher Asta immediately. Uh, bye. <laughs> bye. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Himiko, navigator of the Astral Express. Himiko, I'm lost and confused, but enjoying myself. In other words, she's in charge of where the Express goes. Oh, you're the conductor. March hasn't been any trouble for you along the way, has she? She's been fine. Think carefully about how you want to reply to that. Don't threaten me. Never met a more reckless girl in my life. <laughs> Never met a more lively girl in my life. She's pretty lively. Well, that's the joy of youth. We should take every step forward full of energy. She's a discerning one, isn't she, Don Hung? I have the right to remain silent. <laughs> Look at you all. You've already gotten really close. We're going to be best friends. Come on. Asta's been worried about all of you. Himiko Trial has joined the team temporarily. So now, Himiko's in my party, but only temporarily, it seems. She's, like, dressed in a combo of, like... Like... She's got, like, the, the military coat on. But she's also got, like... Like, the the Greek, like, dress thing happening, or something. I don't know what's going- like... Damn. Um, okay. <laughs> Jesus. Hello, everyone. Why did the Antimatter Legion suddenly come here? I don't want to die. Mom, Dad, my sweet angel, I miss you so much. Oh, God. I- I'm too young to die. I've got things I still want to achieve on this space station. I'm sorry. How about you, masked man? I can't talk to you. How about you, scared man? I, I can't talk to you either. 
How about you, other masked man? Nope. How about you, people? Nope. Oh my god, she shot him. Jesus, I gotta walk. I didn't see a thing. Abraham, former security staff. Emily, calm down and think about what she would do in such a disaster. Ten cups of coffee, a pill, oh. or maybe hide in a room full of mystic scrolls of eons. Oh, that's bitter coffee. <coughs> so bitter. Just drinking it black, it's fine. Too dang bitter. Oh, okay, you don't have to get too angry about it. You just don't have to drink it anymore. Oh, sis, where are you? I'm so scared. Leslie! Sir, I need to go. I need to go find Leslie. Uh-oh. Stupid boy, is your head not screwed on right? Leaving over my dead body. I'll knock some sense into you yet. But hey, where do you think you're go- oh. Well, hey, Watson. Goodbye, Watson. Hello, Joanne. Goodbye, Joanne. Let's go talk to Asta, right? Projectile radar tracking normal. Telemetry signal frequency unusually high. Maintain at normal levels. Our measurements predict that the Legion is about to unleash over 10 waves of continuous attacks. Everyone, brace yourselves. Okay. Asta, we're back. Oh, I'm glad you're all back safe. Arlen just told me about the situation at the storage zone and about his injury. Thank you for all your help. In times of disaster, I realize more and more that the space station's researchers are its most valuable assets. Alas, we were ill-prepared for such emergencies. We should have built up our security and combat departments. But on the other hand, the entire crew of the Astral Express seems to be extraordinarily skilled. What is the current situation on the space station? The situation is under control for now. The damage to our security system was minor. The intruder only managed to alter a small amount of data, so it was easy to fix. The real problem lies with the researchers. They trust Madame Herta wholeheartedly and never thought that the space station would be breached by the Legion. Hmm. A broken spirit is far worse than a broken body. Yeah. I see what she's saying, yeah. Let's go speak with the researchers. Right now, the space station can't afford any more unexpected turns, especially from within. Have you tried contacting Herta? I sent multiple letters, all met with silence. You know her, Himako? The space station is but a mere warehouse for followers and rare items. She doesn't really care about it. I knew it. No matter. I'll also send a letter to Herta and tell her that we've brought the rare item she seeks. At least that might get her attention. Oh, that would be of great help. Do I have to? I guess I have to. Here's my warp. Okay. Oh! I imagine this happens for everyone, right? You just get Asta this way? Is it Asta or Asta? Anyway, um, cool. Ask if Arlen needs help. All right, I will do that in a moment. I'll leave the reassurance of the researchers in your hands. Okay. Thank if you, you have any other questions, you're welcome to come to Himiko and me. All right. Um, do you guys want to be best friends? Best friends? Maybe no. All right, but I'll be around if you want a best friend. Just saying. If only I caught the antimatter legion sooner. Uh, how are you feeling? Oh, I'm fine. This pain is nothing, really. I'm used to it. In fact, I should be proud of it. It's a reminder of being able to protect everyone. Okay. <clears throat> but, uh, don't tell lead researcher Asta what I just said. Right. How's the space station? <sighs> there were a few researchers who didn't make it. Oh. The rest are fine. 
mostly minor injuries. But I'm worried about their mental states. Yeah, everyone's a little upset. Most of them came to the space station because they admired Madame Herta. But now they can't reach her or even their own families. I just hope they can all survive this crisis. What's Asta like? My first impression was that she was the daughter of a rich family. Owners of a big company. Mm -hmm. She was kind to me, though. When she went to the space station, I followed her. I don't know much about science, but I'm glad to be able to protect people in pursuit of their research. Okay. Alright, I'll leave you to get some rest. I hope all this chaos will end soon. I got items. Search for other researchers that need help. Oh, I kind of did that earlier. And I was a huge help, but I'll continue helping. Not a big deal. I don't mind. Hey, you. How's it going, Hinkle? Push the stick down, Alfred. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I got the wrong person. Yeah, don't talk about my stick like that, please. Let me help, Thanks, though. Thanks, kid. We're doing some pre-checks for the satellite remote sensing. I'll hold down the button to monitor the signal, and you push the control stick according to my instructions. All right. But first, let's talk about the controls. Up is the spectrometer, down is the filter, left is the reference level, and right is the attenuator. Okay. Our pre-checks have three steps. Turning on the spectrometer, then the attenuator, and finally outputting the signal to the filter. I already lost track. It's quite a bit to remember. You got everything? No, you're going to have to tell me again. Uh, could you repeat Don't worry, that? Sorry. I'll go over it again. Yeah, please. Thank you. The controls are up for the spectrometer, okay. down for the filter, left for the reference level, and right for the attenuator. Um, all right. The pre-checks have three steps. Turning on the spectrometer, then the attenuator, and finally outputting the signal to the filter. Is that up, right, down? Are you ready? Um, up, right, down. Wonderful. Okay. <laughs> I almost lost it again. I was like, oh that my was god. very helpful of you, kid. Mm -hmm. Alfred was the researcher in charge of this. He was in the storage zone earlier. He didn't make it back. Oh. Abraham was close to him. I don't know how to tell him about it. Yeah. The top priority is to preserve the space station and concentrate on the work at hand. You're right, lady. Oh, man. I remember directions so far. That's nice. How about you? Abraham! <laughs> hey! Hey, you know, Alfred? He's... I need to leave. I need to run from this forsaken... No, it's impossible. I can run from yesterday. I can run from today, but tomorrow will always be one step ahead of me. That's how the future works. Look! The obstacle detection terminal has recorded 142,856 attacks. The next count will be 142,857. That's how numbers work. I know in my heart that when I see that hopelessly beautiful cyclic number, it will mean the poetic end of my life cycle. Um... Life is but a path to death, but not today. How insightful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, of course. The closer you approach death, the more you appreciate life. Yes, obviously. I will pull myself together. Yes, you will. Thank you. That was kind of you. Yeah, you're welcome. And Alfred, by the way, is experiencing that death part right now. And he's probably loving it, I would hope. Obtained after completing the Trailblaze mission in simulated universe first close beta. Oh. Did we just get Herda as a character? Oh, sh this is Herda? Oh, right. They were saying that she looks like a freaking kid. Wait a minute. She's not... She's a doll. What? What? Oh, I don't know if I like that. That's kind of... 
Okay. I have some questions. You're, you're ice, though. That's cool. I like ice. What are you kids doing here? What should we do? They said there are monsters in the storage zone. And the gift I prepared for Master Capote is still in the analysis room of the Department of Implement Arts. Mm. You know, there's loads of monsters attacking the space station this time. And some of them aren't even on the station's records. You're so annoying. Stop saying that. <laughs> How old are you? Don't be a baby. Please stop crying. <gasps> How about I pretend to be a monster for you, huh? How's that gonna help? <laughs> this I, I wanna freaking punt this Adler kid. What the what the hell? Leave her alone. You bully. Oh god! <laughs> Take the express and leave. I'll stay. But let's go. My shield won't hold much longer. You all need to hurry. I'll be here. You've got to fit them off. Okay. Hurry. We lost communications. Are you thinking of going back? Well, let me remind you. That's the doomsday beast. The Legion's planet destroyer. The space station is Herta's creation. As long as the Lord Ravager doesn't intervene, there should be no problems. <laughs> but we can't just run away like this, right? <sighs> the Doomsday Beast can rip off the defense shield like tearing paper. And Herta's not here. The station's defenses are too weak to stand against the Antimatter Legion. Either way, the Legion has the blessing of the Eon, Nanook. They came prepared. And everyone here... is not. That's why we have to leave and take her with us. Hmm? She's... that important? I'm very important. She's the one who can help us turn the tides. Of course I may be wrong. Hmm. As you say so. All right. What should we do next? This is the supply zone where the maintenance crew works. There's a path here that leads to the railway platform. Let's head over there and meet up with Welt. Oh, okay. Mr. Yang? Mr. Yang's here too? Didn't he stay on the express? The Astral Express tracks our coordinates in real time. And with such a huge change in the space station's movements, there's no way Mr. Yang wouldn't have noticed. Mm-hmm. I can almost guarantee that your Mr. Yang is already on his way. Great! Right now, we might be able to handle things if it's just the Doomsday Beast, but if the Destruction's Emanator were to appear... Uh, the Destruction's Emanator? Please tell me what this means. Let's hurry up and get out of here. I'll explain later. Okay. That's fair. But first, I loot. I can't get through. Oh. Uh, the exit's over there. How do we get to it? We walk. Oh, or the control panel. And then we walk. Keep at it. Perfect. I guess that is just a heal. It's not really a, an attack and heal. You won't get away. Oh boy. We're just going in. Still don't understand. I'm doing a thing. Never oh my god. And I'm no exception. Just an orbital see. blast. That's never great. Damn. I want to fight. Oh, I can't. But now I can. Ha ha. You won't get away. She just goes off in the beginning of every fight like this? Too late to repent. Jump. 
the truth of life and death, revealed in an instant. This is the guy with a lot of HP. Is but a vision. Because this does a lot of damage. Boom. And then. Oh, that's the blast. Is the blast multiple targets? Single target, yeah. Batter up! Nice. You couldn't have done it without me. You're right. Oh, shiny. Ooh, sparkly. Shiny, sparkly, happy fun times. Understood. Hi, right, Himiko is supposedly strong right now because she's like a level eight character. Um, but I kind of, I kind of want to use other people. I'm not super crazy about Himiko, to be honest. Maybe that's a foolish thing to say. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh. Stop. We saw a thing. Get out here. <laughs> okay. Hmm. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. We'll just go ham. It's but a vision. Yeah, I mean, it could have been better. Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move. You won't get away. Uh, right. Hmm. This is our chance. Okay. Take this. Ouch. Combat is a series of precise machinations. Oh, he almost died. No, that wasn't cool of you to do at all. I don't appreciate that. Not one bit. The time is now. Okay. Control panel. Yes. Hmm. Okay, let's go over there. Ah, uh, yes, the platform. The express isn't here. It has to be nearby. Let me go take a peek with my sharp eyes. Are you peeking? Till the light takes us. Wait, march! Huh? Wait! <gasps> no! It's a space dragon thing. Doomsday beast. Oh. It's really here. Get down here! Uh oh. Uh, careful, everyone! Oh my goodness. Great. Oh my goodness. Okay. We're in trouble now. You've got a lot of nerve. Ow. The truth of life and death. We're going off. In an this sanctuary is but a vision. Yeah. I did. Not much. <laughs> <laughs> still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the Oh, there's multiple things to target. No I didn't. I targeted the wrong thing. Rules are made to be broken. 
We're going crazy right now. Boom. You have the worst luck running into me. Uh. Okay. Oh, maybe I should have done a shield or something. That probably would have been a good idea. You won't get away. Okay. Okay. Hmm, 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 hmm. Okay, uh-oh. It's recovering? Oh, I don't like that. Oh, it's recovering from the break, though. I thought it was recovering health, too. Ouch! Stop. Okay. All right. Um. Hmm. Yes. My turn. The left hand has been broken. What's this? Let's go. Okay, there goes the left hand. Ouch. Yeah. All right. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. This sanctuary is but a vision. Okay. It just regenerated. Did I mess up? I don't know. I don't know what I did. <laughs> what you what you doing? That's a lot of lasers. Perhaps you still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Let's make it quick. Batter up! Time okay. for a detailed overhaul. Come one, come on. Okay, nice. You won't get away! Clemency? Never heard of it. Wreck that hand. Okay, it's taking the weakened state off again. No, stop attacking. I don't like that you can recover from being weakened and then attack me anyway. I'm not a, I'm not a fan of that. Don't like this kind of thing. Perhaps you need you to stop. You stop that right now. Okay. Um. She's about to drop. Let's go. And she seems pretty important for this fight. Got 
combat is a series of precise Oh, maybe he just had two life bars or something. You know, that that could have been it. You won't get away. Okay. Kimiko just going in. Uh Stab the thing. Battle. Okay, we did it. Phew. I got nervous. I was like, I thought I messed up or something. March. No, March. Oh. I just pulled a piccolo. Oh, shit. Hi, Walt. Mr. Yang, is she... They're okay now. Let's talk somewhere else. And that's it for this first episode. As you can tell, I'm very confused going into it, but it's not a bad thing because I'm very much looking forward to learning more about this universe. There's a lot of cool and interesting things. And the characters so far are pretty great. So for those of you who enjoy Honkai Star Rail and have enjoyed watching my first ever experience with the game in this video, I hope you look forward to more fun and adventures. And just as a reminder, if you join my Patreon or here on my YouTube channel as a member, Scholar Tearing Up gets access to my uncut recording sessions for this game. And if you're interested in Genshin Impact, then you will see those uncut recording sessions as well. I already got some of my Liyue stuff up there. So for $2.99 a month, doesn't sound like a bad deal. So once again, as always, thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. If you liked the video, then let me know by subscribing to the channel if you haven't already, giving it a like, telling me in the comments, or check out the description for additional ways to support me. Every little bit counts, and it means a lot. And until next time, shine on, you crazy diamonds. Later. Oh, 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 oh,